basically you want to hook the vacuum pump up to one service port, then hook up the micron gauge to the other service port, but if it's not possible then just do what you can. You might have to wind up connecting the micron gauge to the vacuum pump. That's not ideal. This configuration will be inaccurate unless you shut off the vacuum pump to take the micron reading. Tiny bubbles rising through the vacuum oil is actually causing the vacuum oil to mist. Your target vacuum is going to be 250 microns. It started raining pretty hard so I didn't record the entire process. I got to 250 microns. Then I turned off the thumb valve going to the vacuum pump so I could isolate the system so only the micron gauge was connected. I waited for about an hour to make sure that the vacuum remained fairly constant. 